Hi guys, it's Sandra here from Creating Spain and I know this isn't the sort of view you would normally expect but there is a reason for it so please excuse. I watched a video today which was done by Tim Holtz and he was using a little gizmo called a glitter duster. Now it wasn't something shiny and sparkly that you dust your furniture with, it was a bottle that you fill with glitter and then you literally spray or puff dry glitter onto your project, whatever it may be. Now that does mean that you need to apply glue to whatever it is you want it to stick to because you are puffing dry glitter. You are not putting a glitter glue on something. It is dry glitter that you are puffing at whatever you want to put it on. So you would use glue, whatever you want to use, whether it be glue, varnish, what have you, in the normal way. And then you use this glitter duster and the glitter duster consists of a bottle with a tube going down into it and um, basically it is like a spray bottle but instead of spraying water or a liquid it puffs out the glitter and it has an elongated tube rather like if you were using um, one of these air sprays uh, to clean your keyboard or something like that an elongated tube which you can turn in different directions and direct the puff of glitter. And I thought, oh, that looks fun, but it's not the sort of thing I'm going to use on a very regular basis, probably. And when I looked at the price of it, I found it was about $6. Well, for me, that probably equates to six or seven euros at least, plus postage. Nah, not gonna happen. I craft on a budget. I don't get things given to me normally, uh, unless it's presents from family. And I cannot afford to have every possible crafty gizmo that I might want. So if there is something that I can make to do the same job, you can bet I'm going to do it. Obviously, if you have the money and you want to go buy another gizmo, that's fine. I'm sure it works beautifully um, and I'm sure you'd enjoy it. So you'll need a piece of paper because you can then just wrap it in a cone and use it as a funnel. You will need some glitter. This is cheapo glitter, nothing special. And you will need one of these sort of eyedroppery type bottles that has a lid that you can remove, like so. Now I buy these in bulk, I buy them 50 or 100 at a time from China and get them delivered eventually. <laughs> um, but they're cheap enough to buy and I use them for all sorts of things, for inks and colours and food colouring and glues and heaven knows what else. So you get your glitter and you put it in here and what you want to do is to shake it like so and then you can just point it in the direction of whatever you want to glitter. And I don't know if you can see that on camera, but it is putting glitter at it in a very delicate and very subtle way, like that. And that is exactly what the glitter duster did. I said, you know, if you want to go ahead and buy a speckle gizmo to do it, that's great. I wouldn't want to dissuade you if that's what you want to do. We'll put a link below to the Tim Holtz video. Uh, he had some good ways of using it, but for me, this is going to do the job just fine. Thanks for watching. Take care now. Bye bye.